It's going to be a wet one this weekend for a lot of folks. Any events around town expect to see some rain. It all moves in tomorrow and uh, we'll sit around throughout the weekend and carry over into early next week too. So enjoy today. This will be one of our last drier days for a while. Yesterday we managed to hit 58 degrees in Portland. A fantastic afternoon. We were warm and mild and just sitting below normal highs for this point in March. It does look like we will enter April in the new month here with cooler than normal temperatures continuing. Uh, again, we'll likely see temperatures only near about 50 degrees heading into the weekend and beyond. Now, so far we've seen only six 60 degree days here. This is a look at the 60 degree tally in March. The last 10 years, uh, notice 2015, we saw that month where we had 21 days at 60 degrees or warmer. So this has just been a uh, much colder March for us uh, and uh, our average number of 60 degree days, usually about nine per March, but uh, we've only had six, so it's been tough for us to even reach 60 degrees. Today won't be a day that we're in the 60s. We're back in the mid 50s today, which will still be nice. We're starting out dry here and also mild. A lot of spots are back in the 40s as we kick off our morning instead of the 30s, which we saw yesterday morning. So no need for that heavy, heavy coat, but still wear some layers here. It is chilly in spots that are closer to the low 40s like Hillsborough and down to McMinnville. Not much fog either. And again, today we're back under mainly dry conditions for the coastline. Expect to keep those clouds around a shot at a brief sprinkle through the afternoon, but otherwise it should be a nice day today uh, back in the 40s to low 50s, slightly cooler out there in Portland back in the mid 50s today. I still think today will be a beautiful day. We'll keep it mainly cloudy with a quick blue sky break at times this afternoon and also shot at some spotty showers there too, but still uh, a great day to get outside and enjoy this last dry day here before we're back under some rain. So there's the radar. Now we do have a patch of showers that is uh, starting to dissipate out towards the west end of the gorge, just east of Portland, mostly out towards Corbett and into I-84 there into the gorge. So be careful some wet roads out in this area, but otherwise we're pretty dry here for the coast and out towards the valley as we start our Thursday morning here. So here's our weather pattern still dry as we head into today. We're in between weather systems, not much going on right now as we uh, set off on this Thursday, but we do have a couple of storm systems brewing away well offshore. These will start to roll into the region and develop as we head towards Friday. There's our next storm and a cold front that rolls in as we head into our Friday evening and very soggy conditions. Once this front moves inland here uh, throughout late Friday night and Saturday, that's when we pick up some heavy rainfall back in Portland. So today we're still again in between these weather systems. The chance for a pop up shower. This model really wants to bring in just some lighter showers this afternoon. So do watch out for that. I would carry a rain jacket, but I think we'll see plenty of dry moments today too for any outdoor activities here. Maybe a sprinkle or two here and there. The coast looking mainly dry heading into our afternoon. Now through Friday, we're still pretty dry to start the morning. Showers will uh, start to move in for the coastline throughout the morning time, but it's in the afternoon after lunch. These showers increase and then they turn real heavy as we head towards our evening and we keep those soggy conditions going as we head into our Saturday and the weekend to also lots of mountain snowfall. So here's a look at your rain chances. If there's a day to get outside, it is today. Uh, so enjoy the drier afternoon here for most around the valley and the coastline back under wet conditions on Friday and we'll keep numerous showers going heading into the weekend and as we start next week. So here's your seven day forecast mid 50s today. Then we cool down or day time highs will likely hover right in the upper 40s to low 50s Friday throughout the weekend. Come Monday too, we're turning colder with our overnight lows in the mid 30s. That means you do have a chance for some hilltop snow once again as those snow levels drop around Portland. So we're going to watch this time frame going into Monday very closely. But as we head into next week, we do dry out by the middle parts of next week, uh, partly sunny and our daytime highs back in the upper 50s.